Okay, so, so far this year, I know the season is just young, but the Golden State Warriors look absolutely amazing. So let's check out some of the basketball plays that they run with their team, and you can run with your team as well. If you want to be able to stop a lot of these plays, make sure to go check out my unbeatable basketball zone defense book that is down in the description below. That's going to double team the low post, but also trap the corners without leaving any players open. Okay, so check out this first basketball play that we're going to be looking at. We're going to have a quick, quick pass from the wing to the point, and then we're going to be having a back screen on that player who is going to then cut to the rim. Obviously, this player who's cutting to the rim could be an option for the pass but as you can see right here they are not looking at this cut as their number one option their number one option in this play is after that back screener does that back screen he is then going to roll off and set a secondary screen for the man who is in the corner who is the golden state warriors three-point shooter at least on this line which is buddy healed and buddy healed is able to come off of that screen and he's able to then go up and hit this three-point shot so basically how this play looks on the clipboard is after this pass is made there's going to be a back screen set right here and player one is going to use that back screen now when it comes to your team, this could be a great option to be able to hit with a pass. Obviously, if you like the apps that I'm using where I can draw on the screen, you can check them out in the link in the description below as well, and you can get 10% off. But after this cut and back screen, what we're going to have is this player is going to set a back screen here. At least that's what we've seen in other clips. Player four will use that screen, but at the same time, after this back screen, player five is gonna roll off and set a screen for player two. And at this time, player two is going to be the main option. However, player three does have other options available, as in player four and player one, who's rolling off of that screen. So this essentially gives player three three different options to be able to get an assist. Obviously with the Golden State Warriors, Buddy Heald is going to be the main option to get that three point shot. Now in this first play, or the second play I should say, they're set up essentially in a five out offense. And what we're gonna see is the ball handler, he is going to be dribbling towards the player who is on this side. This player is going to then exchange spots with him. After that happens, what they're essentially looking for is to isolate Steph Curry on this corner defender. Now, depending on the play and the time, Curry could go up and this can be a dribble handoff. The other option is depending on how this defender is playing Steph Curry, Steph Curry can cut back door. The idea here is just to get Steph Curry a quick open three. Or if Curry is smart, which he is a very smart player, he's going to be able to read what his defender is doing and he's going to be able to cut back door, as we can see right here, nice bounce pass for the reverse layup. Having players who move off ball as well as Steph Curry does allow you to run plays like this. So if you've got off ball of movement that's extremely elite like Steph Curry, you can run a play like this, which is very simple. Here's another, another five out play that the Golden State Warriors run. They go down and set a dribble handoff with the man from the corner. Now, getting that dribble handoff, this is going to be a quick pass back up to the point. At this time, Steph Curry is acting like if he is about to set a screen on this player who is in the corner, but what's really going to happen is now Steph Curry is going to be the one who gets that pin down screen. Getting that pin down screen, Steph Curry rolling off, allows Steph Curry to get the absolutely wide open three. But the best part is, is if this man was to hedge even higher, the roll off of this corner screener, this would have also been a great option to be able to pass to if Steph Curry was being blitzed because there is absolutely no help defense because it's the NBA. So basically how this play stacks up is this is going to be a dribble handoff in this corner, give a little bit of a fake action on this side just to be able to shift the defense because if you want to be able to score on this side, you want to start something or start a play on this side so that now you can shift that defense when you swing that ball around. So coming off of this dribble handoff, you're going to have a quick pass out to the point, which in this case was Draymond Green. And now Draymond Green is going to be having 
Steph Curry set a fake screen down. This is then going to lead into Steph Curry popping out using that pin down screen so that now player five, in this case, Draymond Green, is able to hit him with that pass to be able to get the assist. I hope that this video has helped you become a better basketball team and win some games. If it has, hit that like button and subscribe. Make sure to go check out my unbeatable basketball zone defense book that is down in the description below.